as the saying usually goes, charity begins at home. The causes of addiction are merely nature and nature, and this cannot rule out families. My name is Daiwa Andra, a recovering addict and a therapist. Today I'm talking about families and addiction. Did you know that an addict from a family is an example of an incomplete or non-functioning family? I know this will be hurting, but true. We may look at our families, there is love, there is provision, everything is given, and we ask ourselves, we ask ourselves and say, why? Why is saying our families are incomplete? This is more to what I'm saying, or this is less to what I'm saying. We should further look at our relationship in family. These days, it is of norm and very common, sorry to say, that we've witnessed more of the middle families having, more, having a lot of issues in addiction than the lower families. One, because of the financial stature, children are given more than they can afford, more than they can turn to, and they are not guided on how to spend this money in schools, in universities. And what next? This child will use the money, gets everything he needs, gets the balance, and finds out nothing to be done with this family. When we provide our children with enough resources or more of the resources than necessary, this addiction process takes, press, takes place gradually and successfully, from the right stage of experimental to the dependency. Because this child or this adult, maybe who is under the supervision of a parent, has got enough money to go through all those processes. Two, you know, your best, the best friend of your child, we've lost touch with our children. We don't know what goes around in their lives. We do not know what really pains them inside, what they need emotionally. We only provide for the physical needs, but do not provide for the emotional and spiritual needs. The atmosphere of the family. The atmosphere of the family, this looks at a broad range of family violence, that is domestic violence, 26% of the addiction in Uganda is due to family violence, where a child grows up in a, in a family where there is violence, maybe the father is beating the mother, and the so like. So this child gets emotional distress, gets depressed, and runs to addiction, runs to drugs for relief. Ladies and gentlemen, together we can fight these three factors and make Uganda a better place, make our families a better place. I know there is no parent who wishes any child to be an addict. I have been there, I know what it means. I know what it takes to get over it. I wouldn't want your child to get to that stage. We can do it before it worsens. Thank you.